Hi guys, it's me Karen from Karen's Intuitive Jewelry. Hope you're having a great weekend. I am because I got my gemstone delivery today. So here we go. Let's see if I can make this a little quicker. Not starting out so great, am I? Okay, they always do such great wrapping, right? <laughs> Especially when you get excited, like a little kid in a candy store. I don't know, I'm not a very patient person. Can you believe I make jewelry? <laughs> you wouldn't think that impatient people would be very good at that. But I guess it's because I absolutely love it that I do. I do have to calm down sometimes. That's for sure. Okay, let's see. First up. This is she light and they're all little hearts. <gasps> I love she light. It's actually in the family or is the same as rhodochrosite. Same, I guess, composition. Just blue instead of pink. Look how beautiful those are. And they're all little hearts. Aren't they darling? Just darling. Let's see. She light. Used to treat blood disorders, circulatory problems, reproductive challenges, back pain, and inflammation. I just love them. They're so beautiful, aren't they? Oh, I haven't um, met a stone I didn't love. <laughs> Although I hear some strange things about Moldavite. You guys ever heard of Moldavite? I have not. Um, been able to purchase any because it's extremely expensive. Let me zoom in a little bit so I don't have to keep holding them up. Now, I absolutely adore ruby fuchsite. I love ruby zoocyte as well, but fuchsite is my favorite of those two. And you can see why. Look at that. Just stunning all the different shades, all the colors. I mean, wow. And I must show you. I know it's dark, guys, but look what happens to it. Wow, wow, wow. This is with a UV light because it's ruby inclusions in there, and that's what ruby does. It fluoresces. Holy moly. And I mean, and look at there's a little heart shape. <laughs> it tastes so cool. I mean, now you see it. Now you don't. Now you see it. Now you don't. So, aren't they incredible? Wow, I just adore them. Ruby Fuchsite, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, helps with the treatment of wounds, ulcers, fevers, bones, the brain, urinary tract, kidneys, liver, the pineal glands, early menopause, the intestines, throat, spine, and skin. Aids in strengthening the heart and circulation, 
detoxifies and purifies the body, boosting, sorry, the immune system and enhancing fertility. Isn't that amazing? I mean, wow, what a powerful stone. All inclusive. Mm, just stunning. So I got two batches of these because they don't come around very often. I've only seen them on my uh, stone dealer site. This is maybe the third time in a couple of years now that I've been um, purchasing from them. And let's see, we've got some Laramar. And again, this doesn't come around too often either, and I don't, can't purchase it too often because Laramar is up there in price as well. It's from, there's only one place on earth, and that's the Dominican Republic. No place else can you get that. And they're so beautiful. It absolutely does remind me of the ocean. It's incredible. All kinds of shades of blue and some white, like the foam on the waves. And you guys know by now I live in Florida, but I'm on the Gulf Coast in West Central Florida, across the bridge from the Tampa Bay area. And a great little county. Lived here off and on since 1968. Laramar, gorgeous. These are a little bit smaller, but that's because they're not cheap or we'll say inexpensive stones, but that's an inch or I don't know what it would be a millimeter. I don't have my um, my uh, oh, see, I'm trying to think too many things. My measuring tape that has the millimeters. Anyway, <laughs> sorry, Laramar detoxifies and regenerates the liver treats malaria, is good for fevers and sinus conditions, as well as supports the respiratory system. As you would expect from salt water, think about when you go swimming in the salt water, your sinuses clear up, right? And they always say, um, nothing like getting in the salt water. Gorgeous Laramar. Mm. Man, I got lucky on this batch, this, this delivery. And let's see. I think this is called Rainbow Obsidian. It's a little bit hard to see it, even for me. Um, but it, it sometimes has these interesting uh, flashes. It's really hard to tell with all this lighting and stuff. But it's a very subtle sheen on them. But beautiful nonetheless in the dark, dark black. And very shiny. Love it. Let's see what Rainbow Obsidian. I think I just have it under, oh no, here it is. Aids the body with the detoxification process, unclogs blockages, and promotes better overall body organ functions helps with addictions, including eating disorders, supports the circulatory system, focusing on hardening of the arteries 
and eases pains associated with arthritis. Aren't those pretty? Wow. And a very high polish. I wish I could show you the very subtle uh, rainbow effect, but nonetheless, I can't. Next up, front and center is wonderful ocean jasper. Look how cool they're. They're all so different. Beautiful. And ocean jasper is not an inexpensive um, stone either. Look at that nice heart because it's mined in the ocean. So a little bit more challenging. And I don't know offhand what specific locations these are from. Helps to restore the internal organ tissues, drains the lymphatic system, aids with absorption of vitamins and minerals, as well as balances iodine and sodium levels, relieves water retention, and can maximize the benefits of salt baths and hydrotherapy. Again, interesting that a stone that's mined from the ocean has all those benefits that you would see when you swim in the ocean, clears up sinuses and your respiratory. Beautiful. I gotta get busy creating, guys. I've been doing too much um, unboxing stuff lately, but I, <laughs> I guess, you know, when that shows up, um, you got to jump on the sales and whatnot. And it was fun doing the unboxing and trying out that Timu and that bead bargain, bead box bargain. I just uploaded a couple of videos on that. Just quick stuff that I did to show how easy it is to create with, um, you know, inexpensive pieces. This. A friend of mine, a subscriber, we're now friends because we have so much in common. She had been telling me she went down a rabbit hole not too long ago looking at different stones. And one of her favorites she found, oops, this little one. Looks like it got cracked, but that's okay. I can cover that up. And one of her favorite stones she discovered was called Bird's Eye Jasper. It's super lightweight. And it has all these weird little eyeball looking things. <laughs> Why it's called Bird's Eye Jasper. So this is for you. You know who you are. And they're quite big, two inches on the largest and a couple of cool shapes. And I'm sorry to say I didn't specifically look up the benefits of the bird's eye component, but we can certainly tell you what Jasper's good for. Helps detoxify the body and increase blood circulation, alleviates gallbladder and stomach pains, helps with liver disorders, shortens recovery periods, boosts your energy levels, helps with the urinary system and tissue dysfunction. Very, very cool bird's eye jasper. Look at that. And this is a very inexpensive stone. I got all of these were on a clearance 
for $20. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13 cabochons for $20. Can't beat that. Hang on, I gotta let my little dog out. And next up is Blue Appetite, or I can sometimes say Apatite. It sounds more like a stone. When people say Appetite, of course. <laughs> what do you think I think of? Who, what, what are we eating? But until recently, I didn't realize that Appetite comes in different colors. This happens to be um, the blue. I've not seen anybody carrying different colors of the uh, Appetite. But they're really beautiful. They're real dark. Um, let's see if I can get their light on these. Ooh. Can see some sheen in that. I don't know if you can or not, but I sure can. Oh, did you see that? Oh, look. Wow. I don't know if you're able to see some of that. Oh my goodness. These are really beautiful. They're real, real dark um, aqua turquoise almost and oh boy these are real jemmy wow gorgeous appetite helps lower blood pressure reduces stress and is good for suppressing hunger interesting appetite <laughs> suppresses hunger Okay, maybe I can remember that next time instead of thinking about eating. I'll think about, I'm not hungry. Oh, look how flashy those are. Oh, I can't wait to play with these. Wow. That's probably why I got these, because I have some other ones, but I think I mostly have um, squares, maybe. Do I have any out here? Let's see. No, that's a blue one. This is a square um, appetite, and you can see it's it's very similar, but it's not as it's much darker. Uh, these lights. You gotta have them, but I sure don't like them because they interfere. Now this, I couldn't read this. This was also a clearance lot, and I love Mukite, but rarely have I seen a lot that was all this dark pinky red. Look at the different shades. So I got them just because you don't see too many of this color, except just straight up. This is almost like a burgundy or mauve. Look at that with the two colors in it. So I think this was maybe a $20 lot because it was a, a clearance. And then of course there's there's a dark brown and then yeah, Mukite usually has yellows and oranges and reds all mixed in. But I was like, ooh, I like I like that. Is this a clearance lot? Let's see. Oh, fifteen dollars for all of those stones. Two, four, six, eight, nine cabochons for fifteen bucks. Beautiful. Love it. And I would think, you know, guys would dig it because it's not a fancy stone. There we go. Ooh, 
That's so pretty. Hey, that, that lighting right there. <laughs> right here. Oh, have I found it now that we're almost done? Oh, figures. I'm still learning, what can I say? And I probably, you know, don't have the perfect solution here. This little studio is really my dining room table. This is, now I have some rose quartz, but only the shape that's kind of, um, they call it a kite. And I've had them for a while now, I'm trying to use them up. Let's find the sweet spot here. So these are very, very pale. This one's a little bit darker, not quite as translucent, but very cool. It has um, a couple of these cool shapes. And I love that, look at that. Rose quartz. Beautiful, of course it's a stone of love and it is beneficial to all things heart related, but I'm gonna go there. Two rose quartz. First off, helps prevent thrombosis, which as y'all know is blood clots and it helps fight heart attacks. It ensures the heart muscles are smooth and as strong as possible. It improves the circulatory system. It supports pregnancy by protecting the mother and unborn child. Beautiful rose quartz. I actually requested, um, and I don't know if you can see the different, all the different shades in this. This one's probably the darkest pink. Um, what's rose cut, that faceted um, way that they cut these cabochons, I requested if they ever see them, buy them. Because anything with that cut, oh, that one's really thick too. Look how thick that is compared to this one. Wow. Um, anything with that kind of cut, I, I'm just enamored with because it sparkles and shines and just from the cut. Then I got some super blue flash Labradorite. I mean, I have a lot of Labradorite, you guys know, but when this super, super blue flash comes along, how can you not? It's just gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Woof. It's almost blinding. Oh, I love Labradorite. And I just, and again, I'm pretty new to all this, but I just learned a couple of days ago that Moonstone, what we think of, what my love for Moonstone is, um, the Rainbow Moonstone is actually white Labradorite. What? I did not know that. And there's a, a true moonstone, I guess it's called, um, oh, I'm gonna forget it. <gasps> Can't believe I'm forgetting it. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys. They actually had it in the show tonight. And I can't, I can't think of the name. Oh, anyway. A true moonstone doesn't have the rainbow in the flashes. It's just super, super, super shiny with almost an iridescence to it. I did not know that. And I probably should have bought some. I think I actually have some of that in maybe the peach moonstone, but interesting, look at that. And that's all natural, that's not fake. Hmm. Just love Labradorite. Okay. And I don't know about you, but as many times as I look at these and... Oh, we didn't talk about Moonkite, did we? Or did I? No. Moonkite. 
<laughs> I'm sorry. Beautiful Mukite. Don't want to leave you out. Boosts the immune system. Lowers blood pressure. Restores tissue. Restores tissues. And prevents deterioration of internal organs. Mukite. Sorry about that. And then let's go up to Labradorite. Oh, Labradorite, gorgeous, electric blue, treats disorders of the eyes, go figure, and brain, stimulates mental acuity, relieves anxiety and stress, regulates metabolism, balances hormones, and relieves menstrual tension. Labradorite also treats cold, gout and rheumatism, lowers blood pressure, and aids in indigestion. Oh, look at that. Almost has little, little flex in it. Wow. Oof, oof, oof. I'm sorry, guys. I, I guess I get almost hypnotized with Labradorite. It's just astonishing anyway <laughs> gotta move on here and of course i couldn't leave out my other favorite flashy stone which is what we were just talking about the white labradorite or as i've always known it rainbow moonstone oh my goodness look at these itty bitty little hearts these are all hearts so I bought two of these, two lots. And of course you can't really see the flash from way down there, but when I hold it up, you sure can. And they all flash and they're gorgeous. I just love them. Oh. Wow. You catch that one flash up at the top? Almost reminds me of, um, lightning dang so yeah all of them have a nice flash front and back this one is not even flat on the back it's almost a puffy um, so I'll have to wrap that in a special way Look at that, wow. Who wouldn't love Moonstone? And look at these itty bitty ones. Oh my gosh, what am I gonna do with these? <laughs> They're like too little. There's no way. You guys see how much I struggle. But look at the flash on them. Oh my gosh, oh, I'm in love. But look how little. And you guys see how much I struggle with working with little things, little components, but I just, oh, they're so cute. So, so cute. Wow. Rainbow Moonstone. So, yeah. So, this whole batch right here was a total of $40. As you can see, they're not in the inexpensive uh, realm. Moonstone heals and balances the stomach, pancreas, pituitary gland, unblocks the lymphatic system, relieves anxiety, stress, and cures insomnia. Wow. Gorgeous, stunning amazing rainbow moonstone just love it we'll leave these out right here for our enjoyment <laughs> and last but not least this is a new stone to me too i had seen it once before and Although I liked it, it just wasn't, I guess, time for me to purchase them. 
It's known as Leland Blue, or sometimes called Cyber Jasper. Although it's not a true stone, as here's the history of it, it's only found in one county in the state of Michigan which is Leland County, I believe, or that might be the town. I'm sorry, that's the town. And the history behind this is that they used to have like a mill up there with iron or something. And they were very, very big and it was a big booming town in the 1800s. But because they didn't have a really great accessible harbor they, they couldn't survive. And so when they would create these iron, I forget it's called stag, slag, slag, maybe it's, sl you guys look it up, look it up. I, know, I apologize, I should have had all that information right here to discuss this because it was fascinating. Anyway, when they would dispose of the sludge, whatever, they would dump it into the water because it was like molten iron or ore or something. And over the decades, it would mix with stone and other minerals and make these giant different color blue giant pieces of, they're like rock, they're, they're hard enough that they can now cut them into cabochons and stuff. But you can still find these rocks today on the shores of this little town called Leland in Michigan. Very, very cool. So I just bought them because I thought they were very unusual, especially this guy. Look at that. And I like those little white specks in them and those wild blue patterns. So I thought they were, oops, sorry, very pretty and different and different sizes, thicknesses. So that's Leland Blue. Interesting, huh? And I think that's it, guys, for this haul. And again, this is from Soul Star Crystals on Facebook. And I'll provide a link in this um, video. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed it. Till next time, bye.